I created what I thought was a unique concept in my mind for a business, which turned out to be a business that Winmark had already franchised, which is Music Around. So um, once I discovered that, um, it was really a decision about whether or not to uh, buy a franchise or to try this on my own. So after a lot of research, I decided the, the way to manage the risk of a brand new venture and something I knew nothing about but really wanted to do was through a franchise. The deciding factors for me when I started a music around, I was studying business in college, business management. Um, it was really my passion. And at the same time, I was playing musical instruments in bands and working at a music store. And I just happened to see an ad for a music around in Inc. Magazine and started to really look into it, check out the website, and it, it just seemed like a perfect fit for me. So. The reason we went with music around is um, I was displaced by the company that I worked for, as happens to a lot of people. I was in middle management. I went through an outplacement uh, seminar, and one of the things they said was good for middle managers is franchise opportunities because you're not out there on your own like you would be as an entrepreneur. You have some guidance and help, uh, much the same as you are in middle management. Uh, so looking at franchise opportunities, uh, a friend of mine's son was actually looking into music around, and I became interested in it. And, that's how it happened. My life plan was to start my own business around 40, but I found myself unemployed at 30. And uh, Music Around was one of the options that I had opening a franchise. And I looked around, and Columbus had the number one played against sports store in the country and the founders of Once Upon a Child, and they all seemed to be thriving. And I thought, that concept works in Columbus, so if I take music, I can blend my interest in music and that success that they've done and maybe make it work. And I did. came down to flipping through a book trying to find things. We looked at several different ones. I didn't know Music Ground existed as a franchise. I didn't know it was a possibility. I've been a musician my whole life, and um, I forget what book or where or how, but it was on the page there, Music Around. That's it. You know, that's what I want to do. So it was a pretty easy decision. Opportunity for my family was a big one. Um, getting the heck out of the cold Minnesota winters was a big one. <laughs> I mean, moving from cold Minnesota to a desert climate. Very nice. Um, opportunity to be, to be my own boss. Um, the flexibility that that brings. The risk reward factor. A lot of risk, but potentially a lot of reward. Which, you know, again sets up my family for um, hopefully uh, future security. So that's probably the biggest factors. Got the opportunity because I was pushed out of uh, former employment and saw this uh, opportunity in the newspaper, just read about a little ad in the paper and called up. It didn't even cost me a dime for the phone call because it was toll free and uh, saw it and kept advancing one step at a time until I thought maybe it would start to smell funny and it never did. What made me want to open a music around store is my wife and I were both rather disenchanted with our jobs. We didn't like the fact that we had absolutely no control over our destinies and uh, we could be laid off at any given time and really didn't feel like people appreciated the talents that we had to put forth. Uh, Music Around gave us the opportunity to exploit our strengths um, and in a field that we were really passionate about which is music and gear. I wanted to get into music and I knew I wanted to do a franch uh, franchise operation. So I looked up music and franchise and here I am.